better. Till then, let me pause the recording and restart it. Okay. So yes, I'm trying this whole clever thing of actually micromanaging my research by doing like binary research. Clever shit, I know. How much espionage do I need on Hammy? Let's see his research. Ah, damn, he just broke free. Gotta reestablish that. How much do I need on Ahsoka to keep seeing his research? I won't be able to constantly compete with these guys. But I have liked being able to vest both of them. I think I'm just gonna stick with Hammurabi from now on. Because he is my neighbor. And he is the most dangerous. He is a spearman. Ho, ho, ho. And he would have nothing to gain. And I'm going to whip this now. It took a long time for that city to grow. I, I ain't building a farm there. You retarded. What I need is a cottage. Okay. I know you guys are like, Grimoth, but you're not researching. What the fuck? I have plans. For I am clever. It is true. And you know what I can use around here? That, there, let's see here, six food, five, four, three, two, wow, that's a lot of excess food, actually. That's pretty sweet. But I'm probably not going to work all those mines before I can build another farm there with civil service. Yeah, I'll go ahead and build a cottage there. You are done healing, so move out there. You are done healing, so you move up there, and you move out as well. If I vest everything, how long does it take me? I need like 290 gold. Got it. Okay, so that's fine. I'll just move both of you here like this. Create a formidable wall, which the archer will have to break. If it plans on going anywhere. Which I'm sure it would like to do. Now, eventually, I'll be able to trade for cool things like, you know, alphabet, you know, maybe get some iron working thrown in here. One step at a fucking time, folks. For now, yep, victory, as I presume. Buddhism has spread to my lands. We have two religions on this snaky continent. Great. Religious strife. Hmm, I wonder how everyone else is faring. Don't feel like whipping that because I'm working cottages. How much gold do I have? 152. I run that still. Gonna need like 290 gold. Oracles built. 775 BC. Pro something I could have gone for. Undoubtedly. I'll go ahead and leave this axeman behind. And start advancing this guy. And hopefully I don't become the target of death. That's a spear, but it's a melee unit, so I do reasonably well against that. Okay. Now notice this actually acts like a farm and like a cottage combined. A riverside cottage courtesy of the fact that I have a lighthouse here, which turns all wa which gives all water tiles plus one food. Even these lakes. Very spiffy. Now, I'm actually going to fucking reclaim my tile here, douchebag. It's my tile. You cannot have. Although this city, yeah, it's got that forest. Mmm, I suppose I'll chop that down next. Yeah, not the most efficient. I do need more workers, definitely, for the city. So these, and after this granary finishes, I'm actually going to go ahead and build another worker. I'm definitely lacking in that. Mm. What the hell? Let's go ahead and whip that precious cottage away a bit and start building another worker after that. Because I need more. <laughs> more? Confucianism is spread. God damn. Fucking religion. Orgy fucking porgy. Now, where was Confucianism founded? Well, somewhere on this continent, I presume. Certainly does not help me at all, though. Do not approve. At all. 
Could whip this work boat, but uh, borders still need to grow, and it'll take another seven turns. I'm gonna go ahead and move this guy up here. I'll mine that grassland hill, chop this forest down for that city, and no, I'm forcing you into open land. Fuck you. You're gonna have to go through open land, bitch. S my D ho, S it. Or you can attack me. You might even win. Nope. Run research slider to max. That's cool. Uh, you are heading up there to mine this. Good, 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 good. Good, good, good. Actually start roading through that? Yeah, I can start roading through that so that whenever I do get hunting, you know, iron working the goodies, I can make things go quicker. Chop down that forest, facilitate my growth. You elected to move on to open land, and you are dead. I didn't even lose any health. Bitch. <laughs> mm. Root that. Chop those trees down. Multiple people are going for alphabet. That's not so bad. Let's go ahead and see what I can do about fucking blocking evil barbarian spawns up here. Okay, it's a war. It's not so bad. I've seen worse in my day, for sure. That fucking monument's gonna finish before I can finish job? Well, it's gonna finish at the same time. Son of a bitch. Settler will be done next, and I can build another glorious city for Grimmeth. Borders expand just in time. Ramses! Ramses as well? Most interesting. One hell of a fucking sneaky continent set up, game. One hell of a sneaky kind of setup. I'm gonna go ahead and build a lighthouse there. Let's check to see my uh, my monetary gains here in my cities. Oh yeah, beautiful. Egypt's got nine cities, and it's the founder of Hinduism. You know, since there was Hinduism on this continent, one of those fuckers would have had to found it. And yuck. Do not approve of all these guys together on this one continent. Snaky continent, large map setting, and we're all fucking shoved together? What the fuck, game? Great, just the same shit but less land. God damn it. Probably gonna end up settling that city site after all. Oh well, I sacrificed it. I didn't want to clash my borders so much with him, though. Because uh, that would have led to greater tension. That's something I can certainly do without... Where's my next city location to settle? Is it up here? They claim that silver? Could be. Um, certainly would ta better take care of barbarian trouble. Let's go ahead and attack that guy on a hill. That's the fucking axe. It can afford to do bad, badass shit like that. India gets alphabet finally. And we're pretty late in the game already. You know, we're heading towards the end of the BCs, folks. The next strongest city location, I do have to say, would be up here. I can chop down some trees. Everything will be great. Go ahead and do that. I'm going to need another worker down there. Actually going to have the city work on that. Work on that worker for me. Plocks. Workboat is here next. Uh, go ahead and mine that. And we'll go ahead and take combat too and heal ourselves. Keep roading through this territory. Prove that. I should be getting aesthetic soon enough. Yeah. I'll get aesthetic soon enough. And then I'll partially research alphabet. I'll trade aesthetics for alphabet. And then I'll move on to whatever... Holy shit! Are you fucking kidding me? What the fuck? Where did I meet him at? What? Was his work boat? No, he... You... What? What? Do I see any of his units? No, he like moved off the map. But I see that scout. Are we all fucking together? Oh my god! You fucking kidding me, game? Game? 
I don't know why I'm roading around here whenever I need so much help. Aggie's got fucking... He's the first alphabet, it seems. That's great. So how are we looking at here in terms of relations? Tokugawa's our only serious warmonger, although Izzy can be a warmonger. And Augustus Caesar's not that bad of a, you know, not that bad of a military dude. He just has a high piece. Wait, Hammy can be dangerous. If you guys remember my Hannibal series. Not cool. But I will expand, and I'll get a decent chunk of cities here, folks. I will not be hurting for cities. Which is spiffy. And I can afford to expand into them. What the fuck? Goddamn game. You fucking kidding me? It's gotta be kidding me, right? <laughs> it's gotta be. Go ahead and build a lighthouse there. Granary goes there. Fucking. <laughs> I choose this map thinking we'll have like a fucking interesting situation, and I have no idea what the fuck this clusterfuck is. I got none. Zilch. Zero. This is complete and total trash. Complete and total trash. I have no idea how to explain it. I got none. All I know is... Roads! Fucking A. We're all shoved together on this little shitty-ass continent. Maybe they're just able to explore through the power of workboats. That's it. That's probably something I should have done. Explore with workboats, seeing if there's any future locations to settle, but I mean... Considering how shoved together we are? Oh, man. I don't even know how big this sneaky continent fucking is. I got no clue. Go ahead and build this city here. Obviously, monument comes first. Keep roading through these these territories as if it's actually going to be beneficial to me. You can probably afford to whip that and build a library next. Hmm. That'll be fine. Next turn, I'll kill my research slider, and uh, we'll partially research alphabet. Art for art's sake is an empty. Place. Alphabet's fine. The there we go. Art for the sake you get a lot of gold per turn, folks. I actually got my border pop now. Sweet. That's not terrible. At all. Certainly could be worse. Okay. Lots of AIs are getting alphabet around this time. Spiffy. I can be one more then. I can join the team. I'm going to be able to grow my cities a decent bit with all this help that I'm getting. And that looks like that's the end of it here. Great. So I was able to block off a really nice portion of land. Parcel of land for me to expand into. Certainly not a bad thing. I'll close my tour border pop. Two culture per turn? Oh, religious spread. Yeah, I don't even need to build monuments in these places where I'm getting religious spread. I'm just... I don't know what the fuck I'm doing, but I'm doing it anyway. <laughs> He's doing it anyway! Ah! Okay, I can run my research slider for two turns with that. That might be enough to allow me to, to, to trade aesthetics for alpha. Well, not completely, it looks. Oh, well, uh, let that go one more time. Finish the road. Uh, you go back there, and I think I'm just going to have him defend right there. I'll plug in a final city, like here, and we'll be good to go. Okay. How much is this city going to lack for food? Eh, could use more cottages. You must construct additional cottages. <laughs> Do not underestimate the power of cottage. Especially when you're financial. Especially when you have land. Because you can just not care. And it's so fun. It's so fun not to care. Babylon is going after aesthetics. That's terrible. Fuck. It's not a good thing. Not a good thing. Do not approve. Do not like... 
do not want under any circumstances. Fuck. Mind that. Border pops occurring there next turn. I'm going to have to trade that for value as soon as possible. As soon as possible. Preferably next turn. Um, both of you guys stop working on that road. Please. Okay. I should be able to trade it now. Mm, who's got what? Okay. Start down here with Ahsoka. Ahsoka's going after math. Let's work? Good. Okay. For now, we work on literature. That'll be a good trade chip. What else can we finagle here? We can trade aesthetics for iron working. And hunting, too. That makes him pleased. Let's open borders, dude. You should hammer your iron when it is blowing you hot. Okay. Now let's take a look at our uh, our foreign relations again. Who's pissed off with who? Okay, Toku's mad at uh Hammy. Uh Toku's the worst enemy of Hammy and Izzy. Anybody else got worst enemies? Not that I know of. Okay. I got a reasonable situation. Several AI don't have ironworking in this game. Now, do keep in mind, in these archipelago maps, the AI does tend to be slower in these situations. It's not equipped properly to handle the map settings as much as a human player can be. I'm going to get a great merchant? That's actually pretty useful. You know, I would like a great scientist, but I haven't even built a library there yet. Because I've been so busy with building cities. Now that that's a bad thing, I discovered a source of iron near my capital. Exactly how close is that to my capital? I was about to say, like, if I had copper and iron all there in the big fat cross, that would be amazing. Do I feel like trading more techs away to the AI here to advance their position? What can I gain? Now, Hammy, as we all know, is partially researching this. So if I ask him what he would give me for this, it would be priesthood and monotheism. There are AIs who are lacking monotheism, so it's possible I could be able to finagle that. At the same time, I would be speeding him up if I traded that away. <sighs> At the end, I mean, he's got... What does he have that other AIs don't have? Augustus, theoretically, could trade that to him in exchange for priesthood and monotheism. I'll actually go ahead and make that trade. Go ahead and give me those tax. Nope, don't feel like adopting any civics just yet in this game. Okay, so can I see who's built wonders? Alright. India built the Great Wall and the Temple of Artemis. Uh, Hammy got the Oracle. Egypt built the Holy Shrine for uh, Hinduism. And I don't know who's built Stonehenge. That's good to know. I reckon. <laughs> I reckon. 41 gold per turn. Okay, so I need like 41 times... 10. I mean, look at this. Okay. 99 gold per 99 research per turn that's an odd number and that's based upon various random things you know I do have like a library built somewhere I believe which modifies things but okay total commerce is 99 if I run say 99 90% research and 10% gold 89 plus 9 is 98 I'm losing commerce there folks it's due to the whole way the system works so this is actually more efficient to do this way. You know, I tend not to do it that much because I'm fucking lazy, but with the bug mod there, I can just fucking slap to 100% pretty quickly. So I have that going for me. Yeah. Okay, good. Work those tiles. Become strong, fruitful, and prosper. 
Got a pretty strong start on this map, despite how fucking oddly designed it is. <clears throat> Rome, Rome is over there. There's India. Am I having any border tension problems? Absolutely not. Good, good. Because I would hate to see those. Alright. Allow my cities to continue to grow. I won't be able to build that many cottages here. That's true. But hey. It is what it is. And great. I just remembered. Since I got iron working now, I can chop down that gym site. Needs more workers over there. Needs more workers. And that needs a library. For the great library. Source of iron there. Don't feel like settling for it. I'll settle a city up there. And I'll settle two more cities around here. And that'll be fine. Go ahead and pop that there. How many workers do I have? Seven workers for seven cities. Soon to be eight. That's not actually a good thing. <laughs> Kinda needs more. I need to chop down that forest. Needed to chop that down like yesterday. 55 gold per turn? Ah. Shit. I want to whip this out? No, I don't want to whip that out. Working cottages, damn it. You, though. Fuck you. I'll whip you out. And you can build another worker for me. Because I need it. I will run my research slide.